Now, youth across African countries have been encouraged to utilize their skills and talents towards national growth and actualization of the continent's goal of sustainable development. Now, this was the major thrust of the Future Africa Leaders Foundation, while Brevin Eastman in Lagos, our correspondent Jacinto Abuka reports. It is often said that there is no successful nation as well as continent without her youth's involvement in capacity building. These young people representing different African countries believe the days of blame games and excuses are over. Hence, the need for engagements to bring about transformational changes in communities. Every young African listening to me now, it's not right for us to get gun and kill one another. It's not us to destroy our continent by shooting at the government. But it's right to start from the nearest community, do the change that you need the government to do. We have a lot of agricultural production from our various countries, but there are very few countries that are investing in adding value or processing this agricultural produce. We, we are trying to be our own products. We should not always depend on imported products. So we are trying as much as possible to maximize the raw materials that we have and create value on them. To commemorate the future African Leaders event, past presidents of Nigeria, among others, believe the continent is endowed with potentials, including those of the youths. Africa is a continent that has been associated with disease, epidemics, famine, corruption. But those of us who live in Africa, we know that this is not us. For African continent to grow, we must industrialize and produce what we consume. I just must take this as a challenge and work towards our industrialization and sustainable development. To you, leaders of tomorrow, I say, you are not inferior to anybody. Nobody is superior to you. You are the mothers and fathers of humanity. They are challenging young people not to hesitate in channeling their talents towards developing their communities and Africa at large. The other people to make Africa better, we should not expect other people from the U.S. or Canada or any other re, uh, continent to come and make Africa a better place. You become the leader that you are looking for and help the generation that is rising now, that when they get to the age that we are now, more opportunities will be available for them. The youths were encouraged not to waste time to contribute to their quota in changing the narrative as its stage in time saves nine. Jacinta Ubuku for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.